Yo guys, how's it going? Welcome to episode 18 of our FIFA 18 Manchester City career mode. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day as always. Today's episode, we have two away games in the Premier League, away at Newcastle, and then we're going to London to take on Crystal Palace. The last episode, we picked up our third league win in a row against Spurs, but then a narrow defeat, well a harsh defeat I'd say, to Bournemouth. The start of the build-up to their goal was a blatant foul on Leroy Son. If you haven't checked it out, go check it out right now. I'm still sitting here, I think it's been three or four days since I recorded that episode. I'm still wondering why on earth the referee didn't give a free kick. But today's episode, Newcastle 15th, Palace 18th, which is the relegation zone. And in the last episode, Chelsea lost both their games to Everton and Swansea. So let's start this episode with three points and hope Chelsea drop even more points. Kevin De Bruyne lay it off to Barraga. Who's on the edge of the box? Who's on the edge of the box moving into that space? Gundogan now. Can we get a turn away? Yes, we can. A shot with Gundogan. It's a decent save from Darlo. Wow, seven minutes into the game. I'm not sure if it was dipping in or not. It's a decent strike. Basically straight down the middle of the goal. Comfortable save, I think, for the goalie. But it may have been sneaking in. So it had to be saved. Leroy Son is going to whip this corner in. Cole backs under it. But it's only going to fall here to Fabian Delph. On the edge of the box is Vincent Company. Lay it off to his right-hand side. First time strike from Goretzka. Over the crossbar. Nine minutes in. Total domination, but no goals yet. Colback tries to play it out to the right-hand side, but we should be winning out with Barriga, and we do. Goalkeeper going to throw it out here to the left-hand side. Back to Barriga. Basically, a little one-two with the goalie. Leroy Sani. Go on, son. Over the top. Is it worked out? Is it worked out? Yes, it adds decent first touch as well. Going to cut inside. No, we're not. We're going to keep going onto his left foot. A strike across the keeper. Wow, what a save. Gundogan on the ball forward to Leroy Sane. Here we go. We can break away. Go on, Leroy. You got the pace. Keep going. Look at the space we've got to work with. Here we go. Across to the back post. Jesus, surely. Surely. Oh, what a save again from the goalie. Wow. Gundogan wins possession here. Very well done. Tracking back and winning the ball. Here we go. Go on. Oh, why is he not running forward? But now Kevin De Bruyne. Kyle Walker into Jesus. Down to Leroy Sane. Left-hand side is Barragar. Can we get a shot away? First time strike with Barragar. And it's another save from the goalie. Unbelievable. Go on, Jesus. No, it's a free. Oh, he's offside. Okay. Fair enough. All that hard work and you're offside. Jesus Christ. But what a save again from the goalie. 31 minutes in. We should be at least 2-0 up in this game. Otamendi on the ball. Forward to Goretzka. Out to Kevin De Bruyne. I think this is overlap from Walker. Here we go. Here we go. Who can we find? Who can we find? Who can we find? Back post. Leroy Sane. Keeper again. Keeper again. Getting in the way. Leroy Sane was waiting for an open net for 1-0. Five minutes before the break. But no. The keeper is obviously in the way. Unbelievable. This game is becoming so frustrating. And we still got five minutes until the break. Kevin De Bruyne on the ball. Overlap from Walker. Here we go. Can we find Gundogan? I thought we could. But now Jesus and a little bit of space here. Oh, I was thinking about the return to Kyle Walker. Oh, we get absolutely annihilated. What are you doing? I'm running backwards. Why are you going in for the slide? What are you doing, Clark? A yellow card for absolutely no reason. And a free kick for no reason, to be honest. Like I said, I was running away from goal. What is he doing? But we're going to whip it. To that near post sort of area. It's a decent delivery. We get a head on it, but is it a corner? Yes, it is. Okay. A deflection from the header. And we get a chance to make it 1-0 here. Kevin De Bruyne whips it in. It's a good one. Company gets up, but yeah, the easiest save of the game so far for their goalie. Goretzka on the ball, charging towards the defence. Through to Kevin De Bruyne. Jesus, a touch and a strike from Jesus. But no, again, the goalie is in the way. Oh, my God. I don't know what the hell to do. Newcastle moving down the right-hand side here. Brilliant ball through to Atsu. He's into the box. Is he going to whip in across? He's got bodies in there. He's got his back. Lays it off to the edge of the box. Colback. And thankfully, it's an easy save. Their first shot at goal has come on the hour mark. And thankfully, it was an easy save for the goal. If they go 1-0 up against the run of play, I will... This is the first game of the episode. If Newcastle win after this performance from myself, I probably will turn the game off. Company to his right hand side. 20 minutes left. Gundogan, Kevin De Bruyne. Oh, we totally turned the Newcastle man. Surely for 1 0. No, again, the goalie in the way. 
again the goal in the way of course but Jesus picks up the loose ball now Barriga can we find Goretzka who's on the edge of the box I'm not so sure Gundogan now Kai Walker on the right hand side we're just going to whip it across to that back post it's a decent one Jesus on the volley on his left foot but way over the crossbar 15 minutes remaining triple sub coming up so there is the full time whistle and it's ended nil nil how Darlow just had one of those games where nothing was getting past him. I did up the goalkeeping ability for the CPU from 50 to 60 on the slider. So I may actually put that down because the keepers that we've come up against this season have just been a bit too good. But we'll see how we go in the next game against Palace and then I'll make a decision. So like I said, Palace is our next game. They are in the relegation zone so we should be picking up the win. Zaha on the right hand side, loads of space to work with as well and thankfully a black shirt is in the way, Isco to the right hand side, here we go, through to Aguero from Leroy Sane, can we twist and turn the defender, yes we can, back through to Leroy Sane, surely this has to be 1-0, Leroy Sane! And again a goalkeeper is in the way, only 3 minutes in and the Palace goalie has made a decent save, corner kick in coming, Isco whips in, keeper's going to come out and easily collect, bright start to the game though, hopefully we can keep it up and grab an early goal so I can just settle myself into this game, not worry and get frustrated like I was in the Newcastle game. Bernardo Silva, I actually thought that was a black shirt there, Andros Townsend, but it wasn't and it's going straight to Mendy, not the greatest of passes, but Mendy now into Isco, up to Goretzka, turn the defender, through here to Bernardo Silva, turn the defender, get a shot away at goal, Bernardo Silva, decent save again. Okay. Okay, it's going to be one of those games again, isn't it? Yaya Torre! Easy save. Mendy, nice ball into Goretzka. Not the best of first touches, was it? It was dreadful. And now it looks like they could break away here. Lee to his right-hand side over the top to Andros Townsend. I think this was, but Mendy gets in the way. Isco easily getting out muscled, but he's won the ball back. Go on, son, keep going. That's it. That's what... That's what a one in a team, heart and strength. Here we go, Lee Rosani breaking away, going to cut inside through to Aguero, gets deflected. And straight to a Palace shirt, but they're messing around a bit here. In defence, keeper does the smart thing and boots the ball away, but we should be winning that, and we do. To the right-hand side, Bernardo Silva, going to find Lee Rosani. No, I'm not, I'm going to jump over a tackle. Now Lee Rosani, turn the defender. Oh, he's done it beautifully. Into the box, a strike, a goal. Oh, it's a decent tackle. Well, it's a very good tackle from Tompkins, because I was just about to release the trigger. But you know what? I think the keeper would have saved it anyway. MacArthur moving forward here for Crystal Palace. He's going to hold it up here and play it to the right-hand side now in Wilfred Saha. Into the box. Is he going to whip it across to the back post? He does. Low and hard. But thankfully Walker is there and gets it out for a corner. 21 minutes played. It's been a bright start to this game, to be honest. End-to-end -end stuff. It's a decent corner. Benteke. Was it a save or was it a clearance off the line? I think it was a save from Edison. What a save. He's near post. It was a good header from Benteke. Uh, Mendy would have got it off the line anyway, but it's still a very good save. 22 minutes played, another corner for Palace. It's the deep one this time. Keeper comes and collects it very, very well. Yaya Torre on the ball here. Going to play it short into Goretzka. Play it out to the right-hand side in Bernardo Silva. Back to Yaya Torre. Just so many Palace shirts back into Isco. Lee Rossani on the left-hand side. Turn the defender. Nope, Van Anholt does well. Don't know why he's on that side of the pitch. He should be at left-back, but... Now Isco again. Can we find Aguero on the edge of the box? Turn. Yes, we've done it nicely. Sergio Aguero. And again, it's another save. I think I'm definitely going to... I think... I don't know whether to do it now or after this game. But I'm definitely going to be changing the sliders back. I think I might change it to 55 from 60. I'm not going to put it back down to 50. I'll put it to 55. But Goretzka now on the ball. We've turned him nicely. A curler to the top corner. Keeper's going to come out and collect it easily. Mendy forward here to Isco. Now Sergio Aguero. Little one to Bernardo Silva. Yes, we're going to play it back over the top. No, it's gone to Leroy Sane on the volley. Okay, the lino is not on your team, Leroy. <laughs> Mendy picking up the loose ball. Now into Isco. Sergio Aguero. Right hand side is Bernardo Silva. Turn the defender. Have we done it? No, Van Anholt does well and gets it. It's a bit of a weird clearance, that, to be honest. But he gets out for a throw-in. Who can we find? Isco's moving into space there. Back to Mendy. 
on the edge of the box is kind of Yaya Torre. Now short into Leroy Sane onto his left foot. Maybe back onto ref, ref, ref. I like a free kick there, please. But Yaya Torre. Now Goretzka. Can we get a shot away? Yes, we can. Goretzka is a decent save. It's a decent save again. First time cross from Mendy. It's a dangerous one. Leroy Sane gets up. Going to fall here to Goretzka. And Townsend gets in the way. Oh, 10 minutes into the second half. And again, just like the Newcastle game, I don't know how. I'm not winning. Benteke totally surrounded by black shirts. And I thought he was going to get away for a second then. But thankfully, Kyle Walker intercepts. Here we go. Leroy Sane. Sergio Aguero over the top to Leroy Sane. Surely, surely, surely this has to be 1-0. Leroy Sane. Oh, my God. 62 minutes played. Didn't even hit the target. Come on, Leroy. He's been our best player this season. I think he's our top scorer in the league. And he can't even hit the target there. That is ridiculous. Isco's injured. I'm not sure when he done that. We'll bring him off for Gundogan. And we'll bring on Raheem Sterling for Bernardo Silva. Bernardo Silva hasn't really been in this game. So bring Raheem Sterling on. See if that can make a difference. Mendy on the ball. Through to Leroy Sane. Heavy touch forward. We're going to cut inside. Play it short to Sergio Aguero. Is it going to get through? No. Tompkins does well. Oh, now Townsend plays it through here to Benteke. Hopefully he doesn't get past me here. Going to wait for support in Townsend. Can we make a tackle? Yes, we can. Here we go. Let's break away into Sergio Aguero. Over the top to Raheem Sterling. Yes. Just a bit over hit though. But can we cut inside and get a shot away? A goal. Yes, we can. And another save. Three minutes before the end of the game and I think that will be the final action and the last chance or is it Yaya Torre here we go go on use his straight oh it's a brilliant tackle it's a brilliant tackle but oh, 41 possession again there but I think again it's going to be another frustrating nil nil draw well it was the Newcastle game all over again total domination and we come away with a nil nil I think I'm definitely going to change the slider for the CPU goalkeeping ability for the start of the next episode let's just hope Chelsea have dropped even more points in today's games so Chelsea did actually drop points again they won and then they drew but the gap has been stretched to six points but hopefully from the next episode onwards the goalies won't be bloody invincible because I've changed the slider setting for the CPU goalie ability from 60 to 55. That was the first thing I did after the Palace game. But before we end this episode, I'm going to go ahead and offer Yaya Torre and Fernandinho a contract each because they've only got seven months left on their current contract. Right, so Fernandinho up first. We've given him a squad role of important first team player, a contract length of three years, no release clause, and he wants a wage of £120,000 a week, which is 5000 more than what he's on right now. And additional fees, he wants a signing bonus of £1.7 million, and for 15 goals, he wants £2.8 million. I'll, I'll happily accept that because he isn't going to score 15 goals. So Fernandinho is done. Contract signed. He is staying for another three and a half years. Yaya Torre up next. So we've given a squad role of important first team player for Yaya Torre. A contract length of two years. And he wants a wage of 130000 Like Fernandinho, 5000 more than what he's on right now. And additional fees, 1.2 million signing bonus. And appearances, 15 for 2.1 million. Again, I'm definitely happy to accept that because Yaya Torre has been unbelievable this season but in the next episode we have Watford who are currently below us yep in third place same amount of points 38 points and the FA Cup starts away at Leicester get in there I'm always excited for the FA Cup because it's such a special a special tournament and I'm looking to go all the way of course but that's going to wrap up this video I hope you enjoyed it and I hope to see you in the next one thanks so much for watching guys have a brilliant day peace